Hey, what's up, guys? Transformers and Hogs here with another video review. As you can see, today we're looking at Transformers Revenge of the Fallen Megatron. Voyager class. Um, very nice. Uh, the missile's somewhere in my dad's work truck. Somewhere. So, uh, but the missile does fire. You just press this red button. And it does fire. Very cool. Um, nice green here. Um, uh, people say he did, he mer would merge with the Fallen here. But I've seen the movie and that is not true. Uh, for speculations. Uh, I know that was like four or five months ago, but, you know. Uh, that reminds, that's, that little detail here. It reminds me of a head sculpt from, uh, one of the, uh, from one of the dudes in VeggieTales that I used to watch. I know that's uh, pretty funny. Um, you can kind of see his head right there. But uh, I like to put him in a third mode. I know he's a tank, but like a defense tank. You just flip the treads up, and then uh, kind of bring this over. It's like a defense tank now. Like you can just ro ro run over you. Like I don't know. That's a kind of stupid mode. But uh, yeah, okay. So what you want? To, uh, nice color scheme, by the way. Uh, look the wings here. They look kind of. They look pretty cool. But uh, yeah, start trying. Oh, excuse me, information. What you want to do is go ahead and um, take these and bring it up. Take that and bring it up. Um, to, uh, come, come under here now. And, uh, take the legs and uh, bring them down. Uh, flip the green piece up. Rotate that in and snap it into place. Flip the leg. Now, it's like you bend up here, then you have to. Oh, dang. Okay, it's like you have to. Bend up here, then bend at the knee or something like that. Looks something like that. I'm not for sure though. But do it again. Okay. Flip that up. Rotate that in. Flip it up and bring it down. Then bring forward. Then you have to like bring that forward or something. And there's his legs. So there he is. There is Megatron standing up. And now next, what you want to do is take his gun here and it's like this you pull it out and bring it down it's like that and then his um, other claw is back here just go and take that out and uh... Kind of bring that forward now flip the head down and then kind of bring it forward then uh... take these two pieces and bring it back and there you have Revenge of the Fallen Megatron in, well, not yet. What I like to do, I like to see this where the gun pieces, I like to fold that in. What I like to do is uh, kind of fold this back and kind of fold that kind of inward. Kind of like that, give them like the super cool cape or whatever. You know, maybe have them po posed up here, but I like to kind of get this down. Um, now, I don't get one thing. The head, like, the head is like this far out. Right, that's a little different looking. I don't know if that's how it's supposed to be, but it actually looks kind of cool, actually. Mm, his legs ain't done straightly. Um, his legs ain't done correctly or something like that. There we go. I think that's it. There we go. But, uh, yeah, articulation, uh, oh yeah, neck alive gimmick here. Um, when you bring the uh, in this back real quick. when you bring the arm forward, the extending claw comes up. Very cool. Very very cool. Bend it back. Brings it back in. Very very cool. And then the little gears right here. Just focus. There are gears in there when you uh, rotate and move. Very cool. Um, Articulation, legs can go, well, upper torso can rotate, 360, legs can rotate, 360, um, head is on a ball joint, and the head piece is on a hinge joint, and there's my phone. So if you hold on one second, let me get that text, um, okay, um, the arms can go, uh, this arm can go 360, um, if that wasn't in the way. But, uh, if you, uh, move this, this is, uh, can swing out, so, you know, it can go 360. Um, this, this can bend both ways. This can rotate, so, it's good arm articulation on this one. Um, 
This one has good elbow movement. Um, as you saw, it can go forward. It can go backwards. Um, it can go all sorts of ways, just like this one can. So, uh, feet can go forward to there and out. And uh, so that's about it on this guy. Um, very nice uh, head uh, lighting here. I can get some lighting down here. Uh, let's see if I can do this here. Hold on one second. That's cool. That's cool looking, dude. But, uh, so, yeah, so, uh, um, uh, another thing I did see if you, we can even see that, see that either, but if, another thing you can do if you, uh, bring that up, you can, uh, bring these, bring this down, and, uh, do that, and, uh, kind of give him, like, this super cape with some, like, uh, kind of panels to guard him here. But that's about it for this guy. Um, this guy's cool. This guy's awesome. Um, this is definitely one of the must-haves of the Revenge of the Fallen line. Um, in my person, this is the, or one of the must-haves must, must -haves in the Revenge of the Fallen line. Um, him, Jetfire, if you already seen Prime, of course. Sideswipe and a couple others that are really good figures. I'm very impressed. Mix Master's good, too. Um... Yeah, uh, short for a leader cl uh, Voyager class, though, which I had uh, someone to compare them with here, but uh, I don't. But, uh, Voyager, um, I say because he has two Mech Alive gimmicks. Uh, that's just my reasoning for it. But, uh, yes, yeah, so this is Transformers and Hogs saying go get this guy and have a good day.